This new upgrade is the new LLM kid on the block, and it's Mistral. It's Mistral AI, chat, chat Mistral AI, and it's a French company that has been developing for the last couple years this new LLM, large language model. And we're going to test it out against OpenAI's chat GPT-03 Mini, as well as DeepSeek to see how it compares. And there is something very special about Mistral that I'll tell you about at the very end, but let's take a look at what it is offering before we do our comparisons. It does have web search. You can add images or PDFs to analyze. You can generate images, which we'll compare in a few moments, to at least Dolly 3, and it has a code interpreter. You be the judge. Let's start off with, write a one paragraph story about a mouse and a blue bird and their friendly rivalry. Pretty quick, there you go. Pause to read. Next one, chat GPT 03 mini. Again, same prompt. Of course, took a little more time because it's a reasoning model. Pause to read. Let's see what DeepSeek has to say. We won't use the reasoning model for DeepSeek just for speed. All right, pause to read. So what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Now let's talk coding. Again, a simple game should work. We're thinking about speed, not so much getting into the weeds of accuracy right now. Because again, you generally always have to go in and tinker with the code. All right, write a, write a chess game in Python. Well, that was fast. I think that's faster than O3 Mini. So let's check out O3 Mini. O3 Mini was certainly fast, but I would say that Mistral was certainly the fastest. Deep Seek. Yep, pretty slow. Going back to the image generator, let's give it a challenge. Here's a variation of a favorite. Create a photo of a model walking down a city street with purple gloves. Let's do it. Oh, interesting. That's a pretty good image. Photo of a model smiling walking down the city street. Now, I did make an error. I, I hit this thinking it would make the, thinking that was what I needed to do, but I actually turned it off. So I did it again, and that's a good image. Let's, uh, let's try it again. I like it. I think this is worthy of comparing to Grok. What's Grok look like? Of course, Grok gives us four images. Looking good. What's Dolly 3 do? Generally, Dolly 3 is rather illustrative. Yeah, very illustrative. Nice image, but illustrative, meaning not photorealistic. Let's go over to Mid Journey. Very good. I like Mid Journeys. No, I don't like this one as much or this one, but I like these two. But this has a different feel to it. This is seems too fake to me, but an interesting use of color. I do like that element. Let's um, look at these images. And these just seem so natural and real. I'm going to give Mistral a good thumbs up and may just keep it in the mix as we compare the various image generating models. It's a competitor. So overall, I would say Mistral is solid. As much of anything, I would suggest that Mistral is a good 4.0 model and certainly is comparable to the other models. But the one thing it certainly has going for it is its speed. Oh, and that special thing, it's free. Just sign in with, say, your Google account. Let me know if you've experimented with it in the comments below, and I'll see you in the next video. And, of course, catch us every Monday for the Creative AI Show, where we are two creative guys talking AI.